enjoy it. We're going to have some exciting performances, and it's going to be a lot of fun in this time. Unfortunately, we can't be together, but it's so great that we have the technology, and it's so great for Mark Lanson, our director, to put all this together. We're going to hopefully have a really fun night, get some food, get a nice adult beverage, have a good time. First off, we're going to kick things off. I'm going to start with some Brazilian choro music for my good friend, Thiago Nascimento. for you buddy miss you man all right next up on the program we have a very special song we all know over the rainbow and it's played by our good friend jeff harvick down at the mckinney high school orchestra take it away jeff
Beautiful. Thank you so much, Jeff Harvick, for lending us that performance. We're so grateful for you, my friend. Hopefully, we get to see you soon in person when this is all over. Next up, we're going to have Alex Brumball is going to play a nice piece by Debussy called Gollywog's Cakewalk. Thank you so much, Alex. That was really good performance, man. Uh, miss you, buddy. Hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for all you've done for us and all your performances, keeping us sane during this time on Facebook. Thanks, Alex. Next up, we have Mozart and a kind of night music. We're going to have Sarah Sasaki and Kristen Harvick joining Jeff Harvick and our very own Mark Lanson. It's going to be a good performance. Hope you guys enjoy it. Bye. 
Thank you.
Oh, terrific. Thank you guys so much. Uh, love hearing you guys. Can't wait to see you guys in person. Next up, for something just a little bit different, here at Classical Open Mic, we don't always play classical music. Sometimes we'll do things a little bit different, and this time we're going to have one of the best singer-songwriters in the world, not just Dallas. Raheem Quasi is going to play some tunes, some original tunes for you guys. Really hope you guys enjoy listening to him, and thank you so much, Raheem, for playing for us. Thank you, Raheem. Appreciate you. Uh, love your original music and, and cannot wait to be able to see you in person again. Thank you so much for, for playing for us today. Next up, we're going to have Jeff Harvick come back. And Jeff is going to play The Dragon Hunter. Take it away, Jeff.
Thank you so much, Jeff, uh, and for lending all your performances today. Really appreciate you. That's really special. Next up, we're going to have a performance from our very, very good friend, the Spanish pianist Patricia Garcia Gill, is going to be playing the Waldstein Piano Sonata by Beethoven. Hello, everyone in Dallas. For the ones who don't know me, I'm Patricia, and I'm in quarantine in Spain. I was in Dallas last May and last November, and I made a lot of friends, and I had so much fun. So for the ones who know me, I miss you badly. <laughs> so really, I can't wait to come back to the US to play concerts, live music, be with friends, and I don't know, human contact. <laughs> but in the meantime, anyway, this is a great opportunity thanks to Open Classical for letting people share their passion, the artists and the audiences. So at the end, what matters is that we are doing something together, even in this different way. So thank you, thank you for listening. I hope you like my Forte Piano video. I'm playing the Waldstein Sonata by Beethoven. And I'm sending you lots of love and please stay safe and healthy and hopefully this will be over very soon so thank you
Thank you so much, Patricia. That was really beautiful. Very, very grateful that you took the time to send us a recording and, and grace us with your musical skills. They are quite lovely. Thank you very much. Next up, our good friend Amanda Moskowitz is going to play something. I just see horn, but she will be playing the French horn for you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy Amanda's performance. Thank you. 
Thank you so much, Amanda. That's so great. Great to hear you. Hope you're doing well during this time. Can't wait till we're all together again. Uh, thank you so much for recording for us. Next up, I'm going to take a turn again with our very own Mark Lanson, one of my favorite just p privileges in my career is being able to play with Mark Lanson. And so I'm um, so glad we're able to do that now. And so we're going to play some Bach inventions for you guys. Hope you guys enjoy Bach number four and Bach number eight. Bach invention number four. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, it was really fun getting to do that with Mark, uh, even though we can't be together. Glad we were able to do that virtually. That was a lot of fun. Next up, my good friend, our favorite Serbian-American man who is uh, not only just a legend in the software industry, but he's also one of the leading BMX flatland bikers and a world-renowned uh, photographer. And he's also the lead bass player of an amazing band called Elmer DeFudd. We have uh, my good friend and the president, El Presidente of Open Classical, Nikola Olic. Hello, great people of Open Classical. Mark, thanks for organizing this. Everybody, thanks for watching. Hope to see you all in person soon.
Thank you so much, Nicola. Uh, man, love hearing that. Uh, so grateful to be able to see you and, and hear from you. Love you, brother. Miss you. Can't wait to be able to give you a hug in person. But for now, uh, thank you for sending that video. Next up on the program, we have another Mozart K157. We have the String Quartet by Sarah Sasaki, Mark Lanson, and Mandy Guilfoyle is going to be doing, and I think Mark might be doubling up on this as well. But uh, we got another Mozart String Quartet for you guys, K157.
so much uh really enjoyed that really wonderful playing next up some more mozart we're going to continue with the theme of mozart but this time we're going to keep mark up and now add myself we're going to do mozart's duo for violin and viola except on the viola we're going to have me playing the clarinet part and honestly i think if mozart had heard this i think he would change his mind and, and write it for clarinet but since uh that is not possible uh we'll try to do it now for clarinet and violin mozart's duo Hey there, this is Mozart, duo number one for violin and viola. For my violin and clarinet. <laughs> Thank you. 
Uh, <laughs> interesting uh, doing that the way it was it's very hard to do but uh, I think it worked pretty well doing it uh, uh, virtually like that so hope you guys enjoyed that next up finally on the program we're going to bring back our good friend Jeff Harvick to end it he's going to be doing um, a cello quartet for you guys and I hope you guys enjoy his performance uh, of uh, with his cello
Wow. That was impressive to do a cello quartet with just one person <laughs> doing all four parts. Really awesome job, Jeff. Thank you so much for that. Uh, that was impressive. Thank you very much for all your performances tonight and for every all our performers. Thank you so much, and we really can't wait to be together uh, all together soon. But for now, I have to say, and so, it's been another great evening here for us at Classical Open Mic. Taking over the virtual world every Tuesday at exactly 8 o'clock, playing all your favorite hits from the 70s, the 80s, and the 90s. That's right, the 1770s, 80s, and I wear classical open mic. My name is Brent Buemi. Special thanks to Mark Lance and our fearless director for putting all this together, and all the performers and everybody who tuned in. Thank you so much. We miss you, Buzz Brews. Can't wait to be back uh, there eating some food and enjoying some great music live. But until then, you guys have a wonderful evening. Get home safely. I guess you're already home. <laughs> and we'll see you next week. Bye, guys.